Scrofula. My name is Nicholas Cambridge. I'm a retired GP and currently chairman of the Johnson Society of London. Scrofula is tuberculosis of the lymphatic glands of the neck. The original Latin name means little sows. Samuel Johnson was originally thought to have contracted the scrofula from his wet nurse, but it is now believed that it was uh, contracted from unpasteurised milk from an infected cow. The other name for scrofula is the king's evil. Originally this would have been treated by a little incision in his arm, uh, which would have been kept open to release the evil humours. This didn't work, so at the age of 30 months, on the recommendation of his physician, Sir John Floyer, he was taken down to London by his mother to be touched for the king's evil. This was because it was thought that the monarchs had powers of healing. Anyway, he was taken to London, he was touched by Queen Anne at St James's Palace, and his only recollection was this lady with this long black hood wearing diamonds. He was given a touch piece which he wore round his neck for the rest of his life. Of course, the effects of the scrofula wasn't just confined to his neck, it affected his vision in his left eye and also affected the hearing in his left ear. The effects of the scrofula would have been quite visible. He would have had weeping lesions, uh, lymph glands in his neck, which would have taken a long time to heal, and eventually they would have caused quite significant scarring, which would have been highly visible for the rest of his life. And would have uh, been unsightly to anybody who was close to him.